Still got no clue where I am. Yeah. Hello. It's a car key reader terminal news to photo and use of the elevator. It looks like a priority elevator for crew members or VIPs. I'm not going to be able to use it without a car key. God damn it all, so... This was a waste of time. Wow. We've got a bit of ball. That's pretty much what readers carry in. I wonder what's in the envelope. Scissor Walker to appear any minute now. We know it's going to happen. I mean, look how big this area is, for crying out loud. So, almost a cane from top left. Do you know the music does not help at all here? Not one little bit does it help. Right. Now we're in, I know where we are. Oh, he's not here. We'll go figure. Uh, I can't leave. The game's not making it let me leave. Have I just put myself? I've literally checked everywhere and I can't actually access I'm literally clicking on the door handle, nothing's appeared. Yeah, apparently there's a glitch, you can't you shouldn't actually be allowed back in here. Or the developers forgot to enable stuff back into this room. So if Cesar Walker appeared right now, I'd be dead. I can't even examine anything in this room. Kelly, help me. Help me, Kelly. Oh, I can actually... What's up, you the doors yet? You need to get over here already. You keep wandering out of there and there's no time when you went into that monster. Well, where the flipping hour is the damn flipping door? The call is not going through. Hey, I'm stuck in here. Yay, that means I'm going to have to exit back to the title screen. Hip hip away! So, where would that leave me? Where would I return? It's probably right before the chase. That's what I'm thinking. So, let's see. And that's still done nothing, so it's making it sound like I'm still in chapter 2. Hooray. Continue from the last save point. Yeah, so let's see, where does this take me? Depending on the answer, I'm in the video. Which would be a shame because I've only recorded for 20 minutes. Maybe a little less depending on all the editing. Oh, I'm here. Where's Rezia? Where I've got one billard ball. Okay, do I have Fingy's number? Yes, I do have Fingy's number. Okay, I can work with this. Let's go, but not enter Jabon's apartment. That got me killed. Right, first things first, let's get that billard bill. That was this way, right? And it was just on the left, is it? Yes, that's it, good. So I want the billard bill, I'll probably examine the arms again just in case that activates anything later. So this where the billard ball was? No, oh, no, that was the photograph. Oh, I forgot that existed for a second. Where's the damn ball? There it is. Right, billard ball C. C. Wait, how many? Why are they labeled the letter uh, alphabetically? Well, let's look at the hands. Right, we read all that. Yep. Blah, blah, blah. We can leave now. Good, good. I don't want to ever come back in here. Don't make me ever come back in here, monster. Whatever you do, scissor worker, don't make me run into this room again. It's too dark for my liking. Right, so we're now going in the room with Jerome equals 
game getting stuck at Mooney. I'm not going to ask what that was, but what was that? He just kept like running and stopping on the spot. It was weird. Not that door, I don't believe it was this one. You're doing it again, Rooney. That's really hard. Pathfinding. Right. Door of death. Or oh, having to reload door. The door's locked currently. There's the game's room. So this looks like we got a main puzzle to work on here. So is the guy that died in here? The guy that died in here. What what am I saying? Yep, he he's dead though. That's gotta be so. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well then. Whoa, scissor walker. Fucking scissor walker, I just got here. Go away, you piece of work. Um, I want to look the other way, Rooney. Could you do that? No, shit. Shit, shit. Oh, thank God. You're already fucking tired, Rooney. Why are you already tired? Let's not make the same mistake again. Okay, okay, just get to the door and then we can walk away. One idea I'm having is let's go to the children's room. No, oh, it looked like you could have a hard place to hide in. Because the cinema, because we know hiding places seem to only work once. At least it did. That's what the idea was in chapter one. Wait, do I remember where the children's room is? I've already went past it. Was it this? I don't think this was it. Oh, for fuck's sake, Rooney. Oh, you got a flipping crit then, didn't ya? Oh yes, I was right. Good. Let's hide, shall we? Right, I'm ready, I'm ready. Hello, scissor walker. Um, I didn't have to hold anything or press anything. I'm, 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 I'm happy about this. I'm happy about that. I, I accept that. I accept doing that more often. Takes more pressure off me to not get killed horribly. So, which way does everywhere go? So does that take me back to the cinema big room area? Oh, this looks like a bathroom. Anything in the bathroom? The sink is dented with a faint red colour, suggesting that perhaps someone came to you to clean their wounds. Interesting, so someone was wounded and entered here. Could have been Kelly for I know. The poor clean turret gleams spotlessly. So, this is a hiding place. Is that what is that what that was then? Let's turn that on. Just in the off chance. Scissor Walker's gonna be behind one of these. I can feel it. No? 
Oh, I'm in, I'm in shock about that. The last one, it's the last one. He's going to be in the last one. And... No. Ew. Ew. Yeah. Ew. Let's... Uh, Mooney, just just go, thank you. Well, why do I think it's going to get dark here? Who knows? Okay, so we're done exploring this part of the floor. Unless I miss something obvious in there, which, knowing me, because me, is like, not that, high like, highly likely. I can't speak properly now. I said highly, highly, highly likely. Highly likely. There we go. Uh, Mooney, keep moving, please. Uh, keep moving. When I say keep moving, I mean, you know, use your legs to do running and all that stuff. This will take me... Where, 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 where am I? This must be it. Okay. Um, Kelly, Kelly. I um, think I'm here. Okay, we're here. Yay! That was not very suspicious luck in a law. So who's here? Holy shoot, everyone's here. Why did you not answer your phone, Maria? Nothing's getting through that door. We should be safe hunkering down here until the help arrives. Help is coming? How if I know, but now shit sit the fan. Someone from the crew must at least sent out a distress call, right? Oh yeah, I'm sure they have. Anyway, did you see either Monica or Jessica on the way over here? I didn't, and I can't reach them by phone or text. I... no, I haven't seen them. Damn, I'm sure they're stored away somewhere safe, just like us though. Yeah, 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 I'm sure they are. Hello, Maria. Rooney, you're safe. What about the Professor? Professor Leonard, isn't he with you? Weren't you on the phone with him at the start of that chapter, Maria? No, I'm trying to find him myself. He called around an hour ago, saying he was searching for a way to sort this mess out. That was an hour ago? Okay. So he should still be somewhere on board the ship. I can't say for sure, there's been no word from him since. Okay, I'm gonna talk to everyone once and only once. Who are these people? Who are you? Oh, oh, you're here! I'm awfully sorry that ki things came to this. You're the guy with the eye that Monica helped. Huh? Surely there's no need for you to apologise. Oh, there is. I'm Fugo Boradso, the owner of this ship. And yet I don't have a clue what's happening or why. I am responsible for everything that's happening on this ship. Interesting. Uh, who's this guy with the arm expression right now? Hello, young lady. You seem quite tired. Are you alright? No, there's a killer monster outside chasing us and trying to kill us. Of course I'm not alright. Yes, I'm alright though. Thank you. Why, don't let yourself get in a panic now. So, are you the, like, the calm guy that's gonna save everybody here? Is this the, what we got, or are you gonna die first? To be honest, this kind of situation almost makes me feel excited. So you're the guy that's gonna get everyone killed? Okay. Good to know. Good to know, I know who to blame now. Um, nice to meet you, I'm Mooney. My, my, it takes a special kind of person to greet someone so normally given the circumstances. I'm Angie. You only got in here a little while ago, right? Did you come across the survivors out there? I can't find my husband, John Thompson. Maybe he heard something. Oh, I recognise that name. That's the person that Monica robbed the phone of and all that, wasn't it? No, I've not talked to any survivors other than Kelly, an acquaintance. Oh. At the end of the day, he's a very capable man. He's probably safe and sound somewhere, but still. Is there anybody on board you're, that you're worried for? Yes, I'd like to at least know if they're still okay. Of course, of course. Everyone has someone their treasure. They like that t-shirt you can never be without. You don't realise how much they mean to you until they're gone. I pray your special somebody is, is safe and sound. Me too, I pray they're somewhere safe. 
Yep, and that's now repeating. Good. And now we get to talk to every single person again because they always got something new on the second dialogue. Hello, young lady. You seem quite tired. Are you alright? Wait, no, you, this is repeating itself. Um. <laughs> I see what that's gonna do. No, no, I'm, I'm not doing it. Well, I'll do it after I talk to everyone again. I don't suppose you've run into the ship's captain? He's supposed to assume investiga investigative command in these kind of situations in place of authorities. Alas, I cannot reach him. Well, considering there's a murderer winning a belt, I don't think we can just go, Hey, let's just start an inf inf investigation. Unfortunately, I haven't seen him since the monster appeared. Wishful thinking, I just hope he hasn't already won a foul of that monster. Well, hoping that's not sold. He was the first mate, wasn't he? So he's like second in command. And he, and he bit the bullet. Or should I say dart? Oh, it would put me at ease just to hear from him. I'm sure he's fine. The professor's no stranger to... strangest fiscal exertion. You should see me in the field. Yes, you should be fine. This is so messed up. Yes, it is. Huh? The f professor's missing or worse, but the suicidal loony girl? She's what here peachy as can be. What, what, what the hell, Maria? Maria, what the flip? Shouldn't it be the other way around? You're always dragging the professor down with your death wish crap, and you're the one who's fine? What the frick, Maria? Just leave me alone. Yeah, I said, I said too much. I spoke out of turn, and I might say far worse if I have to keep looking at your face. Maria definitely hates Rooney, then. That's confirmed. I'm going to go look for Monica. M Rooney, are you a mad person? Yeah, yeah, I'm with Kelly on this. Yes, and also the Professor and Jessica. We haven't confirmed everyone is safe after all. Gee, wow, you really do have a death wish. You know there's a murderous freak on a rampage out there. I'm aware of that, but I also have to find a way out of this crisis. Whoa, since when were you the proactive type? Oh, right, your death wish must have busted your instincts for survival. Ah, uh -huh, it's your life. Go for it away. See if I care. Do you have Monica or Jessica's contact details? I don't. Well, you never qualified to be a member of the Beach Brigade. Whoa, whoa. Hold up, I'll send the details your way. And yet you have them both. Listen, it's not just you and me using this place to hide. Everyone back here wants to make it out of this alive. So if you come running back here with that freak on your tail, there's no way I'm opening this door. Got it, I won't do anything to lead it back here. Damn straight, don't let your guard down out there. You must be a loony with a death wish, but I feel bad waking up in the morning with people I know aren't murdered. Wait, is there anything else you want to say to that? Okay. So that's just basically a way of going. We can't run into here if the monster's chasing us. So I figure, do you have anything new to say? No, you say no, okay. I still haven't found a save point, that's worrying me. The ceiling pipes have sprung leaks and pools of water have built up in the corners of the room. So, if everyone in here dies, it's probably because the scissor walker got in through the air vent. Well, I can't end it here as much as I probably like to, even though I haven't recorded long enough to say you could end it. Well, actually, I may have. I do need to find a save point. Where would the save point be? Wait, is this where that door was? This is that way that door that doesn't open is, isn't it? Well, okay, no, it's an elevator. Okay, I'm, I'm still flipping lost. It's unreal. You couldn't get more lost than me right now. That's how lost I am. I'm just super lost. Where the freaking hell? Where even is the save point? I've not encountered a single save point. Am I just blind? Could be I'm just blind. It wouldn't be the first time I missed something completely obvious. Hello, what's in here? Can I hide behind that desk? I cash registered it. It's open, but any money that might have been there is gone now. People care so much about money, even at a time like this. Hello. Hello, what's all this? This is... The head is clearly a, of a different texture to that of a mannequin, and it carries the faint scent of blood. Okay... Is there a charger in here for whatever reason? 
See, as the other characters have found a charge all the damn time, as we only haven't found a single one yet. This section appears to be a graveyard for poorly selling designs. Taz indicating sales savings are door in a slapdash display. Oh, 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 yeah, this is gonna be a good idea now, isn't it? What's behind the curtain? Oh my shock, I'm in shock right now, there's nothing here! Thank goodness, I already thought something might have been hiding back here, so why did you... Okay, that's a hiding place, okay. Okay, I didn't actually think about that being a hiding place, but it's a hiding place. The clothes are out of line with the season of the region, most of them been for April. Likely in anticipation of nights at sea, which are cold even around the equator. Why? Why? What? Why? 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 Just why? What the frick? That's a door? Maybe it's shit in emergencies. I'm so lost now. Does this take me back to the cinema hallway? Lobby? Whatever you want to call this. Yes, it does. Okay. I've got my bearings. I've got my bearings. Wait a second, what's this door? All the lights on the elevator control panel are out. The floor display isn't it up. Looks like it's not working. Okay, so I can do that. Okay. So where do I go from here? I do have this really odd feeling that I miss something in the bathroom. Something tells me there's something there I'm missing. Our curiosity. Wing wing. Answer the phone, Jessica. Then again, she died. I know she died. She's probably dead right now. Perhaps. And of course, Monica ain't got a clue what Monica's doing. Last I checked, she was with that passenger guy. Uh, this is not the way I wanted to go. That leads me back to the... No? No, no, no this is the way I want to go. I thought I was going to say that it leads me to the bar with all the lights off, but that's the other way. This is the way back to the Bellard playroom. I keep calling it the Billard's room. Just because it's got a fucking pool table there. But Billard's room sounds much better to me than flipping pool room. Than playroom, I mean. Let's go back in here and hope the Scissor Walker just doesn't magically appear once again. Seems a bit dark in here. Is there a charger in here by any chance? Several, several billet pods are sprawled hopelessly across the pool table. If I wonder correctly, pool is played with nine balls. Quite a few of them seem to be missing. One, two, three, four, five, six. I've got two, so I need one more. Is that a charger? Is that a charger? Please tell me it's a charger. No, it's a flipping bottle of whiskey. Yeah, don't get yourself drunk flipping. Rooney now. There was a wet circle impression on the table. It looks like someone was just drinking here moments ago. Probably the guy that's, you know, dead over there. I'm not going to search your body again, sir, because it almost got me killed last time. Alright. I can at least do this. Yeah. What? There's a ball on the, on the floor there. What do you mean I can't use these now? Why can't I use this here? <sighs> I could, you know, just take some balls from these. What else am I going to use the balls for then? I really thought there was going to be a charger in there. I was really believing for that. And let me guess, I can't go this way for whatever reason now. Nope. Okay, okay. Well, at least the phone's fully charged. That's always something. I wonder what happened to that other passenger. She probably bit the dirt, but it. 
Right, going in there last time I couldn't do a damn thing. I couldn't look at anything, so I don't know if that's a bug or what. It's probably a bug. Have a weed after I'm done with this. Alright, let's start from scratch again. Look everywhere. Apart from the bar, I've checked the bar, I know what's in the bar. Nothing. Then again, there could be a save point in the bar. Damn Bally convincing himself to check the bar one last time. He goes in, remembers it's pitch black and he hasn't turned the light on. He turns the light on. And we now look around. There's a jukebox in here, yes, we all know there's a jukebox in here. Many bowls of expensive looking liquor are lined up behind the counter. They mean jiddly nothing here. And yep, as usual, there was nothing in here. And that's the photograph, right? And just when I thought something interesting was about to happen. You know what I really hate? The music. It has this really ominous presence, and then it just randomly stops. And the fact it randomly stops always flopping puts me on the edge. Okay, this is the bit where I place, right? I think I need to check the bathroom again. Cause I don't really I didn't really explore that properly, I know for a fact. Mooney, really, every time we get to a door, you do your little weird walking zigzag style. I kinda likely you not to actually do your little zigzag style. What am I meant to do with two bit of boards? I mean I can imagine I need to put three bit of boards on the table. Also, I still got the envelope. I haven't looked at the envelope. There's a handprint there. Oh wait, have I been over here? Well, there's nothing over here, so it doesn't matter if I've not been over there or not. There was nothing there to look at. Oh, there's a charger. It was right here this whole time. Hey! I should recharge my smartphone, just in case. Yes, let's do that. Charge it up. Make sure it goes green. Yep, there we go. All good and in the craziness. Good. Because I'm going to end it here. Thank you everyone for watching and when we come back, let's see what I need to do next. So until then everyone, thank you for watching and goodbye.